Hi everyone, thanks for joining us today. We're excited to talk more about our new product, Google Play Games on PC. Our goal is to help you expand your reach, engagement, and ROI by distributing your games easily across mobile, tablets, Chromebooks, and now Windows PCs with our new offering. My name is Urjan Dial, and I'm the product lead for Google Play Games. With me today, I'm excited to be partnering with Shala Su and Neil Garde, who will be providing context on the multi-platform gaming opportunity, our new customer experience, and our developer requirements to participate in our new program. Let's jump in. At Google Play, our goal is always to make our products and services work better together and fit naturally into the lives of our players. Today, players have access to a multitude of devices that are capable of running games, but many times it's very difficult or impossible to continue a gaming experience from one device to the next. Often progress and purchases do not transfer across devices, and players have to restart their favorite games from scratch on a new device, losing months or even years of progress, which is incredibly frustrating. And on the game development side, we understand it's not always easy to support additional platforms and devices when your code base, engine, tools, and testing process might have to drastically change to support a multi-platform world. And yet, when we look at the latest data, we've seen incredible growth in multi-platform gaming in the last few years. There are over 1.3 billion PC gamers around the world today, with 54% of US mobile gamers also being PC gamers. Globally, over a billion players are already playing games on both their mobile devices and their PCs, which presents a unique opportunity for developers. The player interest and desire is growing rapidly, so our mission was to build a great product that helps make gaming enjoyable on more devices for players and distribution simple for developers. With Google Play Games on PC, we've built a seamless and delightful experience for players to jump into great games across all their favorite devices. With this product, you could jump into a solo race of Asphalt 9 Legends while on the go on your Android phone, check in on your club members in the afternoon on your Android tablet, and wrap up with an epic multiplayer face-off at night on your Windows PC, all without losing any of your progress or achievements. Everything just works like you would want it to. And we've made finding and discovering great games a breeze with our Windows desktop client. We've designed an approachable, easy to use interface to jump into your favorites and uncover new must-haves. Seamless sign-in with your Play Game Services profile ensures all game progress and purchases are automatically carried over for every game. And for developers, the benefits of bringing your games to Windows PCs with Google Play Games are clear. We focused on simplifying the submission process so developers can publish once and play everywhere. The Play Developer console you already work with allows you to do all of this in one place. We know safety and security are important, so we focused on building a trusted and secure runtime. And with the new Play Integrity API, you'll have protections against common forms of cheating and tampering. And finally, we're unlocking new end-to-end -end user acquisition capabilities for PCs, so you can expand your marketing reach beyond mobile and hit your ROI targets across all platforms. We're very excited about our new platform and all it has to offer for developers and players. Shala is now going to walk you through more global market trends and customer insights that will help you better understand the multi-platform opportunity for your business. Thanks, Arjun. Hi, I'm Shala, a strategic partner development manager at Google Play. Before we show you the product we built, I'd like to share more market trends and customer feedback to help you better understand why this opportunity is exciting. Today, there are 3 billion users playing games across the globe. The gaming population continues to grow thanks to better internet infrastructure, affordable smartphone and mobile data plans. Asia Pacific is also home to three of the top four gaming markets, which together have more than half of the world's online population. APAC is also a mobile first market. Many users find it convenient to discover and enjoy games on mobile devices why passionate gamers still own multiple gaming devices, including consoles and PC. To satisfy the large population of players, game developers in APAC have been introducing more high-fidelity games across PC and mobile. Our consumer research conducted last year showed that the gamers in APAC have the highest weekly average playtime of all regions at 17.4 hours per week. Gaming has become an important part of users' life in APAC. We are also curious about how users are spending their time across devices they own. Through another internal Google research, we asked gamers between the ages of 13 and 54 which devices they used to play video games in the past month. 
The results show that many gamers are spending time on multiple devices, often splitting their time across smartphone, PC, and console. For players already playing both mobile and PC games, 76% of them had a strong interest in playing their mobile games on a PC as an extension of the experience. This is an important trip point that helped us better understand the benefits of providing seamless solution to play mobile games on a PC. To better understand what motivates gamers to play games on multiple platforms, Google researchers gathered data from thousands of players and learned there are three major motivations for wanting to play a mobile game on a PC. The first motivation is approachability. Because mobile games were originally designed to enjoy on the go, their rules and environment are less complex, so it's easier to quickly jump in and make progress. The ability to use a mouse and keyboard can also make some mobile games more fun. While playing games, some gamers also like to switch over to different services such as YouTube and Discord to get tips on gameplay, chat with their friends, or live stream their current game session. So multitasking is the second motivation we heard consistently from the users. The third motivation is that it's much easier to immerse yourself in a game when the game is on a larger screen where all of the details are easy to see and navigate. So you can really dive into the game's environment. And PC players can leverage the full power of their machine to play their games with excellent performance. To reflect this growing user trends, some game developers are already moving fast and are beginning to publish their games on multiple platforms. When we surveyed game developers in Korea last year, two thirds of developers responded that they are already investing in multi-platform gaming experiences and they aim to provide a stable and safe gameplay environment for their users. We also heard from these developers that users who play on more platforms are more engaged and lead to much greater LTV over time, which can really help your business to grow. All these trends and data confirm that multi-platform is an important market expansion opportunity for Google Play to provide in order to improve the experiences for our developers and players. To make sure that we satisfy the gamer's expectation and improve their gaming experience, we've launched a beta of Google Play games in three major APEC markets, including Korea, Taiwan, and Hong Kong, so we can learn more about what the players enjoy about the experience as we expand more globally. We look forward to working with all of you soon. Now, I'd like to invite Neil to show you the demo of Google Play Games on PC and talk more about the technical requirements. Thanks, Shala. Hi, I'm Neil, a product manager at Google Play, and I'm going to show you a quick demo of Google Play Games on PC. I'll walk you through the experience of finding and playing your first game on PC. Starting off, you'll see that we're in our Google Play Games desktop client on PC. This is a standalone application you can download directly from the web. On the homepage, we're bringing a great discovery experience to life. After you sign in with your Play Game Services profile, we have several helpful ways for you to find a great game to play. The first is with our rich cards and clusters, which highlight the best parts of the game experience. The Continue Playing cluster on the right-hand side lets me quickly return to games that I've previously played on PC. When I scroll down, I can browse our other featured games and hit the Browse button at the bottom of the page to see our full content library. We have several games available today, and we've focused on bringing the best quality games into our catalog. Here, I'll click on Summoner's War, one of my favorite games to play on my phone. On the store listing for this game, I see more rich content formats, reviews, and more. Installing a game on Google Play Games is as simple as hitting the install button and launching it directly from within the client without the need to download any new EXE files. Everything happens in one place. Once Summoner's War is finished downloading, I'm going to hit play to launch the game in full screen. One of the first things I see as the game starts up is that I'm automatically signed in with my Play Games Services profile. By being signed in, my game progress and purchases from my mobile Android device are automatically restored, resulting in a frictionless experience my first time playing this game on PC. As the game loads, I'm going to hit Shift Tab to open the game menu where I can refresh myself on the controls and make sure my gameplay settings are good to go. 
You might notice that the experience feels a lot like a native PC game, but under the hood, we're actually running an Android binary on the emulation technology we've developed. From a player's perspective, they're playing this game just like they would play any other native game on PC. And there we go. I'm ready to get started with gameplay. We're really excited about this new experience and we hope our players enjoy it too. In addition to the games you just saw in that video, I want to highlight more of our development partners and their games that are available in our catalog today. The games in our catalog are played by hundreds of millions of Android active users. Our partners have managed to bring these games to PC without the major effort typically required to support a new platform. As we heard from Playrix, who has published three different games on the platform so far, Google Play Games has enabled them to bring their games to PC with just a fraction of the development and maintenance overhead that would normally come with a new platform. And with that, I want to dive into how you can optimize your Android game for PC. First, I'll give an overview of our technical requirements, then share what we're doing to make it easier to bring your existing game onto PCs. At a high level, we have four main requirements to be able to bring your game to PC. These are all required for any game on the platform, and we've developed these guidelines based on what we found matters the most to players on PCs. All games will need mouse and keyboard support and to be optimized for a larger screen size. For example, this might involve using higher quality assets and scaling your in-game UI to fit the larger screen. You'll also be required to sync players' game progress across devices so they can seamlessly sign in and have continuity of play between mobile and PC, as you saw with Summoner's War in the product demo. Lastly, to fully optimize your game for PC, we require Android x86 support for the best possible performance. This format is currently supported by many popular game engines, including Unity, Unreal Engine, and Cocos Creator. Earlier, I talked about how we've made it much easier to bring your game to PC. We consistently hear from game developers that distributing to a new platform can require a lot of resources, including upfront deployment work and ongoing effort to run QA and maintain a new code base. We've taken extra care to make sure that you can now distribute your game to all of these form factors while maintaining a single Android binary and code base. Instead of developing a new format, you can just optimize your game for the new form factor and immediately distribute to phones, tablets, PCs, or Chromebooks. While these may seem like a lot of new devices, we've designed our guidelines so that by optimizing for Google Play games, you can distribute your game not only to PCs, but also to tablets and Chromebooks. This is a market of 250 million devices where we see a continually growing number of gamers, a great bonus from optimizing your game for PCs. In addition to everything we've covered so far, we've also created a number of tools to make it easier to optimize your game. When playing a game with keyboard and mouse controls for the first time, learning the controls for the game can be really important. For this, we've developed a lightweight input controls SDK to help you share controls with players through our in-game menu. Second, we have an updated Play Game Services SDK to help support continuity of play between devices. You may already be using Play Game Services, but with our updated V2 SDK, you can now support automatic sign-in with just a few lines of code. Lastly, we have a new Play Integrity API that is currently available in beta. This helps you to detect attempts from players to cheat or tamper with your game on PC and ensure that your game is only running in the environments you've published to. You can learn more by visiting our website. To recap, we see PCs as an exciting new market to expand your audience. We've put in a lot of effort to build a great product experience and make the development and distribution as seamless as possible. We're really excited about the future of Google Play Games and what it means for the Play ecosystem. If you're interested in bringing your Android game to PC, visit google.com slash play slash Google Play Games today to learn more and express interest in joining the beta. Thank you so much for listening to us, and we hope you enjoyed the session.